Hello everyone. Today I like to talk about British weather. Hang on a minute. When you heard British weather, I'm not going to talk about something very negative because I don't want to bring the negativity to my channel. I want to be positive. Um, yeah, just want to um, share some my thoughts uh, about it. Um, I know when people talk about British weather, look. It's dark. It's grey. This is very, very normal um, in UK.、Um, I think, if I remember it right, from October, at least late October, because I remember we went、um, to Cambridge and I already got a cold on. And then November, December, January. February, March. Now it's April. It's very, very end of the April now. I still need to wear a coat, and the weather is not really great. So it's like six or seven, close to seven months, and then we don't really have like a really, really hot weather. But it is what it is, isn't it? I think for people, you know, you live in England. First of all, I like to talk about people who move here. Just remember. Why you move to this country?、Um, some people move here for for their universities, so they study here in UK. As far as I know, I think there are seven hundred seven hundred fifty thousands students from different countries are currently studying in this country. Imagine how they feel if they're from Thailand and Singapore, <laughs> all of these hot countries. I think weather is really, really something、uh, that can really hit you. And、um, so people come here for their universities to study, and some people come here for work.、Um, is it for better job, better pay? Or some people move here for families, for their children, like me. I move here for my family, for my kids, so they can、um, go to the schools here. I just think it's much, much pressure of the schools in China,、um, so I want them to go to schools here. But for people like us, you move here, just think about why you move here.、Um, you know, you move here for a reason, right? Just focus on that and appreciate what that we got. For me, I really appreciate my children could go to schools here, and it's not much pressure, and they're very happy. And appreciate NHS. I know many people complain about NHS. I'm not saying they're perfect, but for me, you know, at least NHS is free, and you don't need to pay for it. You need to know there's so many countries. If you don't have money, and their hospitals are not free, I have seen people just, you know, being pushed out of a hospital because they couldn't pay for their bills. It's true. There's so many countries; their hospitals are not free, and you probably have to, you know. So I appreciate what I got, and I stay here. Yeah, I don't like the weather, but just appreciate what we got, and always remember why we are here. I think for British people, right? You just need to think: okay, is this something I can change? Is this something I can change? If this is something I cannot change, and I've been really, really, you know,、uh, angry about it. If there is something you can change, then that's fine. Change it. But for something like weather, there is something you cannot change. You have to accept it, and all you can change is change yourself. I just want to quickly share how I deal with the weather. I'm not perfect. I'm not great. I still moan about the weather. But I try my best to not let the British, not let the British weather burn me down. You know, beat me up, and then I got mental. I've just tried to be positive, so I've just to share what I do, and I hope that could, you know, help you. Because sometimes I do get messages,、uh, people on social media saying, "Okay, I'm from Japan or some Asian countries," and then. They live in UK. They live in Ireland, and they can't handle the weather. It's so miserable. You know, I do get messages like this, so I just want to quickly share、um, how.
how I do it. And I hope that can help you. So like I said, going back to the beginning, appreciate what you got. If you go to universities here in UK, just appreciate the excellent universities here, the great educational, you know, uh, resources we have here. And if you go to work, you're on work visa, just appreciate you get a better pay and your job is better. Otherwise, you wouldn't move, you know, thousands of miles away to live here, right? And if you've got family, for me, I appreciate kids. Go to British school here, much, much pressure than I would say most of the Asian countries, at least I know. And free NHS and the children also got free dental. So they, they go to see dentists, they don't need to pay. And in London last year, and I think this year, we got free children's school meals. So just appreciate everything what you got. And then second of all, I like to share how I do it. Um, so number one, I just ignore the weather. <laughs> Is this something you can ignore? Um, yeah, just try your best to ignore the weather and then set really low expectations. I just expect every single day in this country, weather is very, very bad. So if you wake up in the morning, you see, wow, blue sky is very sunny. It's something extra. I think it's something extra I get. So I appreciate even more when I see blue skies and sunny days. I enjoy the sunshine. I enjoy it much, much more when it's, you know, sunny. When it's like this, though, cloudy. And then I would just say, it's normal. I accept it. Nothing, just tell yourself, nothing I can do. Nothing I can change about the weather. I cannot change the weather. And what do I do? I think that's one thing. And the other thing is, I write down my plans the night before. So I need to focus on the next day. I have a list. What do I need to do? I need to go shopping. And then I'll get that done. And then I need to do this and this and this. Just wake up in the morning. If it's a brilliant day, and then there's something extra. I appreciate that. And so only, you know, when I live here, I don't take weather for granted. If it's nice weather, then I enjoy it. If it's not wet, nice weather, then I still need to go through the list. All my daily tasks I need to finish and make sure I finish. Just focus on what you can focus on. Ignore the weather. Try your hardest to ignore your we the weather. If you need to go out and get this, this, and this done, just it's raining or whatever, just get it done. Well, unless it's lightning, really dangerous. But I doubt in UK we get weathers like that. And it is difficult because, especially it's very end of April now, and. I think this is a very, very funny April. I don't feel like this is spring because it's still quite cold. When I'm home, I still need to turn the heating on. And then one day you can go through four seasons. But like I said, there's nothing we can do. Uh, I like to share is try to change your um, holiday, holiday if you can. So for example, um, I can't change my holiday because um, I got kids at school. But if you not got children and you try to go on your holidays in November, and then when you come back, you got December, and at least it's Christmas, you got something to looking forward to. And then if you can, and then go to holiday maybe middle February to middle March, that kind of thing. And then at least when you're coming back from, you know, March and April, it's getting warmer. Just enjoy the summer here in UK because in summer, weather is much nicer. And it's so expensive to go away during summer holidays because kids off flights and hotels, everything is, you know, very, very expensive. Yeah, if you can, just change your holidays to the quieter seasons and change the holiday to the months um, a cold and dull and depressing here and enjoy summer that's what i would say um yeah i think that's everything i like to say um it just it is what it is um try to appreciate what we got 
and always remember for us we're not here we're not from this country we stay here for a reason whatever reason you have let's just appreciate what we got and if there is something we cannot change then we accept it and focus on what we need to focus on i think for the british people here yeah again the same it's something you can't change just accept it still enjoy the life and change your holidays and enjoy summer if you can and if you can change it like i don't like the weather here i move to somewhere else much warmer i get the sun every day you know if you can that would be great uh, but if you can't then you can't move to another country for whatever for whatever reasons your job your family or here then let's just accept it and just appreciate what we got and then carry on just always remember don't let this british weather bring you down right that's very very important okay that's all i want to share and i hope you find this useful and i'll see you next time bye